world is full of injustices. If you grow up and don't spend your time trying to turn these injustices around and replace them more, with more just patterns, uh, you are not a citizen. 16,000 people are subjected to homicide in our country, in homes and on the streets, a year, give or take. Last year, according to OSHA, 58,000 Americans died from workplace-related diseases and trauma. Preventable? Last year, according to the EPA, Environmental Protection Agency, 65,000 Americans died almost often horrible deaths from air pollution. Preventable? Last year, 45,000 Americans died because they couldn't afford health insurance. That's 800 a week. That's over 100 a day. Let's take corporate crime. Can you imagine the, um, the hundreds of billions of dollars that consumers are cheated every year? Credit card gouges, contaminated food, usurious interest rates in banks, deceptive advertising, shoddy merchandise, you name it. That doesn't even include what Wall Street did to us. But look at corporate welfare. Subsidies, handouts, giveaways, bailouts. Why is it that tax dollars are used to build baseball stadiums and football stadiums while recreational facilities and the neighborhoods are inadequate in number and not properly repaired? The last excuse is it won't make any difference anyway. Eh, I get engaged, I vote, I go down, I turn out, march, nothing happens. Uh, so why try? Well, that's exactly what the corporate power brokers want you. That's why they spend so much time telling you from your earliest years that there's a certain way of running this country, and the corporations are going to run this country, and they're going to make sure they're going to control our government, because it's about only our government that can really take them on. Remember, all social justice movements start with people who have no power whatsoever. So don't ever say, well, I can't do this and that because I don't have any power. Because throughout history, every social justice movement started from the victims, the aggrieved, the peasants, the workers, and they didn't have any power. The greatest gratification in the world is contributing to more just society.